Hi friends, Morgan here from Freedom Cosmetics. Uh, we're having a very chill day today, hence the oversized hoodie. <laughs> this is going to be a very relaxed video. Um, we're going to be talking about dry skin today. This is another video in the skin type series. If you haven't seen any of the other videos, just scroll back a wee bit and you'll find them. I've already covered uh, problematic skin, combination skin, normal, normal skin. And was there another one that I covered? Oily skin. That was the other one. I lost my train of thought there. That happens quite often, do. <laughs> I hope you can forgive me for that. So, um, today we're talking about dry skin. Um, dry skin is not something that I might per I have personal experience with. I normally only get the odd patch of dry skin, but I know that my my mum would have super sensitive skin. Um, that's what we're covering in the next video is sensitive skin. So, stay tuned. Um, but today we're covering dry skin. So sometimes if she her skin is particularly dry, it uh, dry skin, the definition of it is that you have small pores that are barely visible. Um, your skin can feel quite tight because there's a less elasticity in your skin, so there's less there's less give. Your lines in your face might be more noticeable. So what I like to call them is your experience lines or expression lines. So expression lines are smile lines. Sometimes you'll have little lines under your eye. I do. Or if you're like me, I take after my dad. I have my father's furrowing brow. And as you can see, even though I'm not furrowing, the lines are still very, very visible. What can you do? It's part of skin. You're going to just stare at them the whole video now. And um, skin, when it can be very dry and very itchy, sometimes it'll peel in areas, which of course just adds to the redness, adds to irritation. Um, sometimes you do get uh, like the odd pimple patch. It can be very, very strange. Um, your skin can also be feel quite rough and scaly. You'll have like a dull color. Um, you'll have an uneven texture, almost like a rough complexion. I don't want to say scaly, but it's 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 a little similar to that. Um, particularly on hands, elbows, knees, and the bottom of your feet, actually, is an area that you might get really, really dry skin. So for people who have that, I recommend the Oasis face bar. I have it here. Give me one minute. Ah, here it is. Okay, this is the Oasis face bar. And um, I have it more for my mum. I got it for my mum. The Oasis face bar is super moisturizing. It's got arrogant oil and shea butter and like it's it's all the good stuff. Super, super moisturizing to the skin while also being lightweight. Okay, that's super important. For me, I don't like to feel like I have a moisturizer on my face. You know what I mean? So when you put moisturizer on, sometimes you can feel there's like a layer. And it's it's like, oh, I, I don't I personally don't like that feeling. I know some people do. Um, but the moisture bars are super lightweight. It's super fast absorbing as well. Like I tried the Oasis one because I was like, you know what? I want to switch things up a bit. I want to try it. Um, my skin was particularly dry that day. Coming winter time, I do need to hydrate more. So I had had a really rough day and my skin was peeling and cracking in areas. And I thought, oh, this is quite weird. So I tried the Oracle bar, not the Oracle bar, sorry, um, Oasis. And holy moly, what a difference. It was like instant hydration. I put it on, I was like, whoa. And it was just, it was insane. And it was so, I was so surprised because I thought I would feel it. But I didn't. Once it was on and you only need a very, very small amount and you put the smallest amount on and it's just like your skin just goes and it's, it just sucks it right up. I was like, yeah, give it to me. And it was brilliant. And my skin, it had so much more bounce. There's a lot more bounce to the skin. Areas that are red and irritated, immediately the redness was just soothed. It soothed the skin. It felt so nourishing. It was super moisturizing. And the other thing that I really liked about it was that it didn't aggravate my skin. It didn't, I couldn't feel it working into my pores. It went on and it was like, it belonged on my skin. That's how it felt. And it's super, super important that you have the right products for the right type of skin. So Oasis is definitely the moisture bar to have if you have dry skin. Hands down, 
like that's the one you need um so with that i'm gonna wrap up this video i hope you guys have an absolutely wonderful day um like comment share make sure you're following us on facebook instagram twitter we're also on youtube head over to the youtube channel hit the we like button maybe subscribe if you feel like it entirely up to you helps us get out there and the more people that know about us and the information and the wonderful products that we provide the more and it's the next step to a more natural way of living and you're going to not only look after yourself look after the people you love and the planet and the environment which is so important because we only have one planet we got to look after it and with that i am going to let you people get on with your wonderful day i am sending all my positive vibes your way look after yourself stay hydrated and protect your skin i'll see you guys in the next video bye